I didn't expect that at all. Hello, how are you? Good? Yeah. It's lovely to be here. I got some good news. Guess what happened to me this year? I got engaged. <laughs> what, what? It's very exciting for me. I don't know how you feel about it. Um, it's great though. He, um, he, I know. We we're both surprised about that. Um, uh, he's great. We're both in our late 20s. He's 29. I'm 35. And he's very tolerant of me because um, I have some mental health issues. What? No, stop it. Shut up. You never guess. Anyway. And the nature of mental illness is that I can be quite up and down. So every night he gets to play a game called Guess Who's Coming to Dinner? <laughs> Even when he wins, he loses. I've seen uh, a lot of films about mental illness. I've seen One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest and A Beautiful Mind and all of Adam Sandler's films. And <laughs> it's heartbreaking, it never gets better. Um, but anxiety is probably my big one, that's my top seller. And a lot of people would not guess that I had anxiety, uh, worms, maybe. Um, but not anxiety. You'd be right, I have had worms, I've had both, so you are right <laughs> on the money there. I also have depression. Well, I was actually diagnosed with evolving depression and it's just nice to have a doctor who believes in you, you know? Like, he had one look at my mental illness and he said, that thing's got potential. <laughs> um, and as a result of those two things, I also have irritable bowel syndrome, which is the sexiest of all the syndromes. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you'll agree. There's two different kinds that you can have, though. I don't have the... I don't have... I don't know what that one... <laughs> I, don't have, I don't have the one. I don't... Uh, I don't have the backed up one. I have the... <laughs> I have the one where you go, oh, I have that one. And, uh, and people get very uncomfortable when you say the D word. So I came up with a euphemism a long time ago. Uh, so when I'm having an IBS attack, I say that I'm having a closing down sale. Because everything must go. <laughs> and you can use any synonym for closing down sale. You can use clearance sale, fire sale, liquidation. Probably should have opened with that one. So I've got IBS, I've got anxiety and I have depression. I am what the doctors refer to as a triple threat. <laughs> and how it all plays out is it's sort of my... All of this panic is sort of personified in my head by a little lady called Beryl. I call her Beryl because that is an ugly name for an ugly woman and I'm sorry if anyone in here is called Beryl <laughs> but you look like you've all just come out of the womb so I very much doubt that. Um, I'm sorry if anyone knows a Beryl. Oh, my friend, has a, uh, she came up to me and she's like, Felicity, my grandma's name is Beryl. I'm like, oh, I'm so sorry, I'm not going to change it. Um, <laughs> It's not my problem. So uh, where Beryl sort of flares up the most is when I'm trying to go to sleep. I have insomnia. And, oh, if you haven't had insomnia, mm, it is like jet lag for people who can't afford to travel. Mm, 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 mm. So I'll be trying to get to sleep. And Beryl is like, do you have any friends that constantly have terror in their eyes and the only way they can feel better is if they just emotionally dump on you? That's who Beryl is. So I'll be lying there trying to get to sleep. And she comes in and goes... <laughs> Are you, are you trying to get to sleep? Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, can I just ask you one question before you go to sleep? Yep, all right, just hurry up. Okay, um, you know the film Junior? The, the one where Arnold Schwarzenegger plays a pregnant man? Yeah. Yeah. In that film, when he gives birth, does he give birth out of the eye of his penis? And if he does, how come no one talked about it at the time? Okay, bye. <laughs> or sometimes she just does a little drive-by. <sighs> Carol looked at you a bit funny tonight, didn't she? What? Yeah, when you said that thing about her hair. Did she? Yeah. Okay, bye. <laughs> Or the worst is when she tries to help. Oh, that got excited. <laughs> Whoa, I like it. Anyway, I don't know what's happening. I, <laughs> I'm a sick person. I, uh, the worst is when she tries to help. <laughs> are, you, are you having trouble sleeping? Yeah. Why? Because you're here. <laughs> oh, okay. Do you want me to just... Um, Sing you a lullaby. I'm blue. Da 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 da
I'm sorry for the person that I made eye contact with down there. <laughs> Someone's just sitting there going, I didn't pay enough for this ticket. <laughs> So, uh, so I have to do things to sort of make myself uh, feel better. I do that one. What's the one where you go, no, you can't make me. Stop it. No. Uh, exercise. I've started exercising and I hate it. And uh, I meditate, which is a beautiful daily reminder that I'm trapped with my own thoughts forever. Mmm. So relaxing. And, uh, and I do get outside help because uh, just left to my own devices, it'd be me eating ham out of the packet myself in the shower <laughs> don't worry it's really good ham um i've been felicity ward you've been lovely have a wonderful night thanks for listening <laughs>